we're showing nine laps remaining. Oh, my goodness, there's a fire there at Fred Jones Racing. That's... That's cut. Nick Perkett's car is actually still on fire. They actually need to get some extinguishers. The team's that down that far end, Red Bull Racing, and uh, Shelby Power are there with extinguishers to put it out because obviously there was a massive ball of flame in the lane of BJR and everyone has run to the attention because Nick Perkett's car was still burning. It is the feed line, actually. The feed line has come off the nozzle. Oh, my goodness me. That's I mean, a ridiculous amount of fuel. Yeah. Never see that, do you? There's a, uh, we've got a camera here, actually, boys, if you want to... That starts oh, because the right flame here. came off the start, yeah. Murph. Yeah. So what erupted it was the start-up methodology. Yeah, so I didn't realise you were watching the vision there. So you could actually see it. Rihanna and I were standing here watching it right at our feet and it was pouring out of the hose before they connected it, out it came. But what I wanted to say was a remarkable response by the fire extent, the, the firemen around here. Here it is from the other angle. So the coupling has come unstuck and then fuel's gone everywhere. And as he's kicked the throttle, it's ignited. But the back of the car's up at this stage. So we're going to finish under the safety car, I've just been informed. Here's the replay again. It doesn't take a lot of fuel to make that kind of mess. And uh, all credit to the CAMS marshals. Bang! Oh, unsafe release. That takes Dumbrell out of the game. Dumbrell stalled, which made it more confusing. Wheel There's off. a wheel, wheel off. off. Tim Slade's car number 14 that Ash Walsh is driving. So there's chaos in this pit lane. These scenes here, watch the right rear corner of car 14, Ash Walsh, Tim Slade, wheel parts company. Brad Jones thinks something had broken in that car. And if you just caught it out the right hand side of screen, the whole right rear brake disc and rotor has parted company on here. James Courtney out of business, unfortunately, for today. And how's the oh, arrival? Oh, bang! And that'll be contact. He's gotta hit him. He's gotta hit him. That has hit him hard. That, that's out of business here for Van Gisberg, and that's a huge mistake. He's arrived, and I can see it happening in the background and giving it a major whack. Yeah, which one's that? Like, coming, 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 window they can't open the door major issues there there's damage from that uh, contact earlier in the race they were concerned about this situation not being able to open the door david reynolds has had to climb through the window as you can see they were well prepared for it but didn't expect that the door was not going to be able to be opened oh look at this david bernard was set to go after changing tires and his passenger door just opened up and they couldn't jam it shut now they're putting their fist into it tape onto it anything they can to shut the thing he was ready to go. David Bernard is now wasting an eternity in pit lane as FPR do everything they can. Heavyweight material into Bernard's car. Greg Rust. Matty, he was on the radio on the way into pit lane to warn the team that this was part of the problem. FPR were looking so good. Glenn Seaton currently in pit lane as well. The team have actually got that car in the garage. Uh, yeah. Cable tied. Right. Passenger doors flown open and uh, couldn't get the plastic glass out of the air. Uh, his shoe has melted. <laughs> they are standing by with a replacement boot for David Reynolds, which in this stop they will attempt to fit. Just pulled in, the door's been opened, the netting is down, he's got his, it's his right boot, they've got the leg up. They're now trying to somehow, without Dave, unfasten himself from the seat belts. Yeah, this is not going well, Brett. They're really going to have to work on this. Letting themselves down on the boot change. Look at Davey just looking on. That, that is the boot that's come off. Look, completely delaminated, <laughs> busted, burnt, Brett. melted, gone. Can you confirm or deny that Davey Reynolds is currently getting a pedicure? <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's You're clear to go. Billy, I can tell you there was no fire, but what actually happened here? One of their crew, one of the crew, one of the Kmart crew hit the deck. He's okay. He's up and about now. Tank still connected. You'll see it there on the left-hand side. Look at that. Oh, man, what an ugly mess. And really dangerous. Well, how lucky we didn't get a big explosion there. There is an enormous amount of fuel there. Highly combustible material. They were on it quickly with the foam. Yeah, again, he is. Um, uh, uh, well, Murphy's out of the car, guys. He is fuming. He came down pit lane and he said, look, this is crazy business. Might as well put the car out the back. The 
You're telling Todd to get in the car. No, he's going... I think he's going to take uh, use of the facilities here. But he is fired up. There will be those that have stayed out there who might just make the one move on to Wentz, which puts them a stop up. Now, has he got away with that? With that? Oh! oh. oh that's... No. It's very, very hard to stop the car. Our Dave Lovell was our cameraman there. He's OK. We held our breath for a moment. But, uh, he's back on the job. There he is at the front of the car. You've got well to, done, go, Dave. You've got to try harder well, than that to get him down. Thanks, Dave. Involved in big incidents. This is oh. 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 oh, Bradley Jones just getting caught up. The three other drivers have stopped so far. When the car drops, you're right to go. Go, 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 go. Oh, oh, there's a drama here. It wasn't properly disconnected. It's just gone straight out and straight into him. In fact, uh, I tell you what, it nearly got the guys on the front right-hand corner of the Red Bull car here. Watch this. Watch the Red Bull boys. They were almost cleaned up in this. That's an awkward moment for everybody, and that's the reason why the rule about safe releases exists. Big contact. Lounge. Oh, look at the oh, Wilson stops. Skate oh, straight through. That is so dangerous. Now they're going to have to take it back in position. Brake, please, brake. That is. Going up, please, Paul. Thank you. Sorry about that one, mate. Well, exactly the same thing just happened to Garth Tander. Somebody's taken a whack here. One of the crew guys, one of the toll HRT guys, a bit buckled up. Cold tyres. Oh, oh again, again everybody one. through. You just got to slow up. He took the gamble. Watch this. Sorry, the wets. Oh, 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 oh. oh. Well, he come to whack in the leg, sprung back up. Nine cars have come in. Contact. Well, that is from the contact with Will Davison in pit lane. Michael, that is a tough way to end the day. Oh, look, it's extremely disappointing. I mean, um, you know, well, as soon as I got out of the car, I went and spoke to the Eris guys, and they told him not to leave, and um, he obviously just didn't listen. And I think the way Will's driving already is shown today. He's, um, you know, he's a bit out of control. Will you catch up with Will a bit later? Oh, no doubt, yeah. I mean, if he was man enough to catch up with me anyway. Courtney's actually found his way into the top ten through all this. Oh! oh! That was coming in. That's that dip at the entry to pit lane. Oh, that oh, is an lucky. unbelievably good bit of driving. Another couple of feet, you would have been hard into look, that look, wall look, on the look. right. Oh, oh, fantastic driving from Courtney also. That is as good as no. it gets, and they're all spun round in the same spot that the guy rated. GRM cars is backwards at the lane, oh, right at the lane everywhere. entry. And he's been collected too. Oh, he's collected the wall coming in through there. We've got a car rotated, and this is Garth Tander trying to get by. This will cost him time. It's Holdsworth. It's Lee Holdsworth. Holdsworth. Where in this race? Van Gisbergen caught up at the entry to pit lane. They're still trying to get Lee Holdsworth's car out of the way. So this is it. This is the ramp that I was talking about. One tap, sideways. Two taps. Rotates. A really good bit of driving by Lee Holdsworth there to, at the end for that to have spun. But here's Ingle. So Carl Reindler, Ingle, and there's Van Gisbergen. Now, they won't be too impressed with the fact that that's happened after the fact. We hit it. The, the fact that Van Gisbergen's arrived down there with a lot of flags out and what have you, after the fact, that that would not be uh, smiled upon at all. Good luck with this. Get lame, get lame. Davison, race leaders in. Winterbottom, Reynolds, Wincup, Van yep. Gisbergen, Lowndes, and Coulthard. <laughs> but he's holding them up, mate, because he's trying to give himself room so he doesn't have to stack for as long. And uh, Brad Jones, who's... With us today, he's left his bloke out, so Jason Bright staying out, going to the top of the field. Wait, 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 go, 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 go! Oh, oh! That's Will Davison being released. Oh, look at this, Slade's had to stop. That's kid. That's going to hugely affect a bunch of cars. That's going to make contact. It's going to make contact. What a mess. Yes, definite contact. Oh. Have a look at this. What a mess. A top up of fuel. Let's look at this here. Yeah. 1999, the action in the pits just got a little too hectic for Jason Bright's crew. Winterbottom in. Lounge stays out. Dumbrell obviously on slicks. Gizzy Van in. Gisbergen in. Dalberto uh, in. Uh, Holdsworth. Holdsworth in. So, <laughs> oh, here we go. That'll be 
Todd Kelly and Jason Bright. Let me call you up Tim Don't Slade, you Fabian Coulthard, James Moffat. It's a, almost the entry list. J Jason Barguana, Russell Ingall, Warren Luff. I wonder whether Triple Eight were contemplating it there until the very last minute. This is the second start of the race, oh, and this is the bumping jewel. Look at that, between Tim Slade and James Moffat. And then they're all down the inside. I've never seen so many cars start. Have a look at this. This is the most amount of cars I've ever seen start from pit lane. They're all running into each other. That was Tim Slade. They didn't need to do that, actually. He damaged cars with 250k to go. And check out Junior Stevie Johnson's go. I'm not going anywhere near that. I'll just wait till they all go through, and then... And they're still on. Still on. This is what happened between Coulthard and Moffat. It's just ridiculous. Is that Holdsworth needs to stop now to avoid trapping. Well, he's coming up behind the Team Kiwi car, and if he gets there, any sort of warmth there, it won't do him a lot of good in terms of coming out. Come out of oh, big oh, big oh wheel off! Wheel off, right where you wheel off. And down pit lane. And she's parked. That's over and out. That's over and out. It was very fast to get this down. <laughs> Oh, he didn't actually have the gun off no. properly. No. And that wheel was never on. You could see it. There's the nut. Yeah.